crippin' after work. Right now, I'm gonna get some gasoline for my generator. People are taking time to prepare for Francine as it makes way from Louisiana to Mississippi. With this storm expecting to bring up to six inches of rain across the entire state, MEMA official Mallory White says all Mississippians should be doing the same thing. Hurricanes are not just a coastal issue. These, this is going to have residual effects throughout the entire state. White says they expect Francine to come with some force. Our biggest concern, obviously, uh, damaging winds, but of course flooding and lots of flash flooding. So especially if you're in those low lying areas, by the end of tonight, all of your preparations should be in place. Not only do you need water and non-perishable food items to prepare for a storm, you also need a plan. Mima says you should build a disaster supply kit, packing batteries, chargers, flashlights, important documents, and more. People we talked to said they have no issues taking this advice. Several of them already haven't gone through Hurricane Katrina, which passed through Louisiana as well. When Hurricane Katrina came, I had nowhere to go, literally in the dark at night because no lights were anywhere for a few days, actually. And again, if they tell you to evacuate, I would highly recommend you evacuate because we saw what happened with uh, first Katrina in New Orleans, all that nightmare that happened. Brooklyn Joyner, 16 WAPC News. <laughs>